everybody, as part of Fire Prevention Month, um, we want to kick off a little safety series of videos um, about uh, basically serving up fire prevention in the kitchen. Um, kitchen fires are one of the leading cause to home fires, uh, and a lot of it is very preventable. Um, first of all, you don't ever want to leave your stove unattended while you're cooking. That's another leading cause that can start your um, house on fire just in a quick moment's notice. Um, we talk about the three foot rule where kids should stay three feet away from the stove. And simple things such as just keeping the handle to your, to your pan in. So somebody can't hit that, knock it, hot grease goes out, causes a fire, whatever the case may be. Um, having simple things around, such as baking soda, to be able to snuff out a grease fire really quick. Or even a lid, having a lid nearby where you can put a lid on something very fast and, um, and suffocate the fire and put it out. You also want to make sure that you don't have any flammables near your stove, um, towels, things like that, that could catch on fire easily. And so certainly, you want to have your smoke alarm. Now, we encourage everybody at the change of clocks, change the battery in your smoke alarm. Some of the new models are 10 year, and they'll go and uh, they'll alert you in the 10th year when, the, when it's done, and you'll, trust me, you'll know it. So, but again, if you don't have one of these and you have one of the older models, every time the clock changes, please change your battery in your smoke detector, thank you. Um, also, you should have a fire extinguisher nearby, and if the event that you do have a fire in your kitchen, um, you should know how to use it, pull the pin, take it, want to try to sweep the base. And put your fire out. So, um, appreciate you tuning in. Subscribe if you get a chance, and um, be safe, and let's prevent fires. Thank you.